What's happening, you guys? I'm back at it. It's the weekend. So, opened up and uh, looking at the ladies. Well, first off, the Sour OG. It's been flowering for uh, a couple weeks, not too long, actually. It's looking super frosty. Looking super uh, delicious, super bomb. And uh, we're just waiting so this lady can pack on some weight and that's what we want from uh, this type of lady we want some weight gain uh, I don't I wouldn't suggest you guys say that to uh, any of your girlfriends uh, wives or uh, any female for uh, any human female for that matter but uh, that's what we're waiting for for the, the sour OG waiting for it to gain some weight and uh, in a week or two I'll be checking with the uh, microscope so we'll see until then uh, just real quick I cleaned off a lot from the bottom since I haven't been here uh, I decided to uh, do that right now and as you can tell it's looking clean it could probably be a little bit cleaner but it's it's all right. Uh, so I have more air circulation in between and all around. So that's good. Um, let's see the old place where I topped off right there. Um, and yeah, you guys, uh, this is the one I just took out not too long ago and sprayed it down thoroughly. Since there's no flowers, um, I, I was okay with it. I just sprayed it all over and uh, yeah we'll see what happens and I did put these uh, pest strips on the bottom so we'll see what is uh, crawling around for the most part everything's looking good uh, let's see sour back here it's looking awesome multiple tops as you guys can tell and uh, we'll wait for that one I kind of uh, was thinking about taking it off that pot so I could uh, kind of lower a couple inches and uh, I'm kind of hoping that would uh, help out a little bit stretching a little stretching out more I usually don't like the stretching out but um, I figured if it stretches out a tiny bit more there would be uh, bigger longer buds but uh, I'm okay that's why I kind of just left it there and I said hey what the what the hey I'll just leave it there and see what happens and uh, it's really I'm not expecting too much out of it since it's in a two gallon smart pot so it's not like it's gonna be a you know big producer like this but it should be close to it since I had some time to work on it and everything so uh, and this one up front you could tell it's I mean it's bushing out multiple tops everywhere kind of thing and uh, yeah, we'll see what happens, you guys. So that's about it for flower. And um, over here, my veg, as you could tell, trimmed and cleaned a lot. Now I can actually see all the way to the back and water a lot more uh, easily. But uh, that's what I did. Let's see, back here is the sour um, up front. It's the last OG I have, the OG Kush. And uh, just these two are sour OGs. So, since these are going to be in here for quite some time, that's why I went ahead and topped it and trimmed them back short. And uh, we'll see um, in a couple weeks how they explode and how they grow. And uh, maybe in two or three weeks, we would have the sour OG. Um, around the weight we want it to be so um, that's kind of like a guess obviously we'll have to wait and see exactly what's happening with that plant back there but if it's looking good I'll be uh, starting the flush process just so I have everything in the soil clean and uh, you know nothing but water and uh, I'm gonna really try to flush it out all the way uh, and wait until the uh, plant basically yellows out in the smart pot before cutting it down 
and that way um, it's it's clean it flowered all the way and it should be burning awesome and smelly and uh, most importantly clean and that's what I'll be expecting so we'll be uh, keeping a close eye on that one for about three weeks two and a half something like that we'll see how much uh, weight it can put on but right now they're decent sized buds if I were to cut them down right now I wouldn't be totally disappointed but we'll wait let's gain some weight so as you guys could tell I'm kind of sure I could have uh, cut them a lot shorter but um, I didn't do it to these ladies I mean they've been through a lot they're starting to look like mother plants but uh, that'll be good because their roots pretty sure in here their roots are already kind of starting to get root bound I'm gonna have to transfer into the uh, two gallon smart pot soon but that's fine that's okay uh, we'll see how these uh, explode how these grow out uh, let's see up here didn't do too much kind of just left them how they were and uh, as you can tell it's looking good short bushy just how uh, I want them and uh, like I said since these are going to be in here for quite some time you can only imagine how uh, how much time these are going to be in here most likely roots are getting root bound so maybe in a week week or two I'll do something about it but uh, and that's about it you guys just cleaning up making sure uh, it has air circulation and um, hopefully they don't die in here since they're gonna be in here for quite some time um, I'm, since I have plenty I might have to uh, kill some off might just throw them away I know you guys don't want to hear that but that's what it seems like is going to happen so um, let's see anything else you guys not much I'm kind of le kind of uh, stoked about weed being legal now in Cali as you may have heard it's awesome I'm going to kind of wait next year to see what happens um, and uh, what the county has to say what the city has to say about it so um, it's good times you guys good times I'm, I have a week off so Thanksgiving since I work at a place where uh, they have vacations quite a lot I'll have a week off do some things and uh, catch up I've been wanting to uh, remove the mylar off the sides and just kind of paint it flat white but that takes time which hopefully this week I will have plenty of so until next time you guys like subscribe let me know what you guys are uh, have been up to let me know how your plants are uh, how they're doing and until next time you guys much love keep on growing um, I want to let you guys know just you know be legit you know don't be a stereotypical stoner and uh, that kind of makes the rest of us look bad you know, um, I guess that's all I could really say is just try to be, try to be responsible. So, uh, with that being say, said, you guys, uh, much love, peace, and until next time.